What is going on guys, Tiswava here, and welcome back to some more Slime Rancher. Let's jump right back in. Now, last time we left off, we finally did one, I think we did one mission, not two missions. For Victor Humphreys, he invited us over to his lab, and now it looks like we could actually do like a special mission for him over there, and I definitely want to try that out here in just a bit, you guys. Oh, oh yeah, I forgot I was loaded in, uh, I loaded out of the game whenever uh, we're looking at the gold gordo right there, which by the way, we need to, we have the golden ginger over here, or gilded ginger. We, we can make him explode, but I do want to wait until we have more gilded gingers and we're able to give him, because he's going to explode in like four or five, six, or something like that, gold uh, little little slimes are going to come out of him. Definitely want to have some gold gingers ready to actually feed those guys, because if you guys saw last episode, we got five gold plorts, these ones right here. When we fed a gold ginger, a gilded ginger, to a gold slime, because we had a 7z rewards thing over here that we actually bought, and it gave us like a, in, I guess instead of getting like maybe one or two or something like that gold plorty out of it, I guess you get five when you give it a gilded ginger, which is crazy. I wonder if you still get more whenever you give it like like anything else, like maybe if I give it a cuberry or something like that, would I get two out of it or would I still just get one? I don't know. I guess we'll have to see. Or maybe, yeah, it's probably just going to be one. I bet you only get more when you give it the gilded ginger there, right? But either way, you can see on the bottom left, I have a lot of money right now. Speaking of 7Z rewards, I kind of want to keep buying these just because, hey, why not, right? Like, what else am I going to spend this money on, right? <laughs> we have 120,000 till we can actually get this one with the Titan Drill Blueprint, which I definitely want to maybe place over in the, the quarry, the Indigo Quarry. Sounds like that's got to be crazy to put over there. Pretty loud chroma, nightlight chroma. Why don't we look at our colors here in just a bit? Slime Trophy 3, Abyssal Pump. So that must be like the Tier 4 or something like that pump that we could put over in the... Uh, like right off, out, outside of our base, you know? So that's gonna be crazy. 150,000 new bucks to get that. We're about 100,000 away right now, which uh, honestly, it, with the money that we're making now, with our, our base being almost completely automated, you know, with the, the, the drones taking care of all the plorts and stuff like that all over the place. And these guys keep throwing their prickle pears all over the place. <laughs> uh, but yeah, yeah, with the drones taking care of everything, you know, it, putting food where they need to go and then collecting plorts and then putting that over here in the in the storage, which I need to, I need to tell this guy to sell the plorts here pretty soon. And uh, hopefully we'll get a lot more money out of that because I'm sure we will. They're just $97 uh, for the gold plorts, so we can get a lot of money from the five that we have right now you guys like 2,000 basically sheesh I don't know if I want to do that right now though that will take us basically to 50,000 but I don't think I want to do that just yet let's put all the primordial oil up spiral stream up here and uh, you can see that teleporter over there to the left is actually activated now let's go and take us to Victor Humphreys area definitely want to go check out what that's about here in just a sec and then uh over here do I want to make that market oh pot attack oh that's the ah oh. That's that thing with the face. We need a couple more pepper jams and then some tango plorts. I guess I never put any tango plorts over here in the uh, refinery, so I definitely want to do that. Uh, what else was I doing? Oh yeah, I was going to make the market link, wasn't I? Now, do I want to actually make the market link and place it down anywhere? Or do I want to actually just keep it in my inventory all the time? Kind of like what we're doing with the uh, refinery link. And then, of course, just placing it down when we want to sell something. I think that's what we're going to do with this market link. So let's do that. 565 pink floors here, you guys. It's crazy. So there you go. We fabricated that. And yet we can make another one. It's just that the only thing we're missing is royal jelly there, unfortunately. So that sucks. So if we ever have any plorts in our inventory and we want to sell it, we can just uh, do this. Place it down anywhere. So uh, let's see. Warp tech market link. Boom. And there we go. We have a market link. We could sell stuff. Like, uh, do we have plorts over here? Yeah, we have plorts over here. Oh, 213 even more pink plorts over here. This is crazy. But yeah, I can just grab these, go over there to the market link, sell it, and then put market link back in my inventory, and then we're good to go. So I definitely think this is the strategy we should do with a market link rather than putting it in a specific location because I know. Uh, oh, whoops. Oh, it just fell back inside there. Because I know uh, basically every area over here has a market link, except for I think the chicken area, right? The overgrowth. I think that's the one that doesn't have it right now, right? And this one, of course. Uh, but we should be able to... It, 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 just me transporting this thing all over the place. That should more than make up for it, right? So, yeah, we're only getting 8 out of that. And occasionally we get a 16, but that's not that big of a deal. We have so many pink ports. I, I only have these guys, so I can have a lot of pink ports for the fabricator over here. Because a lot of things seem to need uh, pink ports for the fabricator. Either way, let's go over here, let's go to Victor Humphrey's lab. This is what we checked out at the end of the last episode, and I was like, oh, you know what, the video's pretty long, we need to end it off right here anyways. Uh, so now we're over here, I assume this is going to unlock whenever I actually do his mission like two or three times or something like that, just like with Moshi Miles and, uh, uh, what was his name, Ogden Ortiz. So, looks like we start the mission over here, let's go answer his call, and let's see what Victor Humphreys has to say. What in the world is he wearing there, what? <laughs> Hello, Beatrix, thank you for taking time to assist me with this project. It is a matter of great importance that 
uh, something. Uh, uh oh. Oh! My apologies. I am in the middle of some uh, delicate work, and I sometimes forget I'm wearing my immersion field. Pfft. That's what that is. What? Oh well, now he's not wearing it anymore. He still has like big Game Boy on his uh on his chest there. <laughs> Now then, the matter at hand. I need some assistance in testing an in-development, simulated reality of the far, far range. I am attempting to use a simulation to predict slime behaviors and evolution. Ooh. Alternatively, you could call it a slimulation. Oof. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Just a, just an awkward silence right after that. <laughs> hmm. I had calculated a response of at least a mild chuckle from that wordplay. Yeah. No, you didn't get that at all. <laughs> at least not from Beatrix. But no matter, let's proceed. My slimulation is an infinitely complex project that could be the key to understanding slimes on a level we've never dreamed. However, it is sadly riddled with bugs. Well, not bugs per se. Uh, technically speaking, they are a flawed simulation of a slime that has discovered a way to replicate. Fascinating in its own right, but very much disrupting my studies. I call these entities Glitch Slimes, and I need you to help me collect them for study. Here's how it works. Enter the slimulation and begin exploring. Your goal is to collect Glitch Slimes, which will automatically be turned into bug reports the slimulation. However, this is easier said than done. Glitch Slimes have exhibited a curious behavior of conforming to their surroundings, perhaps to avoid detection from me? It's not clear. Refocusing the discourse, Glitch slimes will look like normal slimes and objects in the environment, though something is usually off about them. Ooh, let's see what that's all about. I'm, I'm curious about that. I wonder how obvious it's going to be or if I'm going to be like, okay, I, I don't see anything here, you guys. And I, I walk past like a thousand of them without even realizing it. To reveal them, back up the suspicious slimes and use my handy debug spray on suspicious objects in the environment. Ooh, interesting. As a reward for your efforts, I'll grant you Manifold Cubes, a special multi-purpose resource I invented, which you could use for fabricating unique gadgets from the blueprints you'll find in the slimulation. Interesting. And as we conclude each major phase of our work, I'll also grant you additional rewards, but more on those later. My research has determined that adding mystery to reward mechanisms incentivizes participants to try harder. Oh, and this is really not terribly important, and I'm certainly is quite nearly under control, but... Due to a data corruption in the slimulation, there will reach a point where tar-like entities will begin appearing and taking over the slimulation, and you should really get out right away. Ooh. When this occurs, I'll be sure to signal a beacon on this first available location where you can safely log out. Just follow the exit markers when you see them. They'll lead you to the exit portal. Okay, great. Glad you have no questions at all. <laughs> Especially about that last bit. So, let's get to work. Uh, I actually did have a qu- Oh, oh he's gone. Okay. <laughs> Slimepedia, proper testing procedures. The slimulation is a lot to handle in its current state. Check the Slimepedia for proper testing procedures. We kind of got a little bit of a lowdown from him right there. I guess we can look at the Slimepedia here in just a bit. So those are uh, what the glitch slimes will turn into, like little data logs or something like that. And then when we give him a hundred, he gives us one of these things, and if we give him uh, 20, he gives us one of those cube things that uh, I've already forgot what it does. <laughs> I guess we'll find out a little bit later. Uh, let's see. Hello again, I hypothesize. hypothesize you're seeking another summary of how to engage. Oh, I guess, yeah, he's just going over it. Enter the slime relation and begin looking for glitch slimes. They will be disguised as slimes or objects that will seem out of place. Step two, back up suspicious slimes and use debug spray on suspicious objects to reveal glitch slimes. Back up glitch slimes, avoid taking damage, and most of all, avoid the tar-like corruption that I promise to fix as soon as possible. <laughs> when the exit portal opens, follow the exit markers to the portal and safely log out of the slimulation. The glitch slimes in your vac tank will have automatically converted to bug reports. Turn them in and be rewarded with invaluable scientific data and other rewards too. Uh, but the data! Please note that in the interest of efficiency, I have recorded this exchange should you call again during this phase of the project. I will simply replay this recording, okay. <laughs> hmm, but that last part is not material to the instructions and should probably be edited out. Uh-oh. That's true to the last statement I just made about editing the previous statement, and... Uh, uh, thank you, Beatrix. Goodbye. <laughs> I like this Victor guy, he's pretty funny. Well, either way, yeah, we just need to get 20 and then we get this cube thing. He didn't go over it right there, unfortunately. And then we get 100 and we get some mysterious device. So that seems interesting. So how do we get into there, though? This platform? Oh, wait, hold on. Oh, wait, no, that starts the thing. Oh, yep, it is this. Ooh, so this is how we enter the slimulation. 
guess we'll go. The Slimulation, hidden in plain sight. Oh, this is the, the dry reef. Oh, look at the music. Or listen to the music. So hold on. Wait for an exit. To exit the Slimulation, you need to wait for a teleporter to activate. I'll let you know when one appears. So... Hold on. Oh, that's debug spray. Ooh, use debug spray on glitch slimes disguised as... Oh, wait, hold on. Is this a glitch slime? I thought I saw one right there. It looked kind of weird. Oh, wait, is this a... What was that? Oh! I knew that one looked kind of weird. Hold on. Any more around here that are, uh... Hold on, what about the debug spray? You know what? Whoa! One of these real... No. Oh, I guess... Hold on. Wait, what are the debug... Hold on. I'm confused about that. <laughs> I thought the debug spray... Uh, let's look at the Slimepedia. Oh, here's a glitch slime. Vacuuming them up or using debug spray will reveal their true form. Okay. So I can just spray around and then that should... Oh, wait. Excuse, look at that guy. He looks... He looks super weird and then... Oh! Okay, so we want to look at the one... Like this one? Is this one glitch? Oh, oh, that was a bunch of glitches. Whoa! Hold on, hold on. Get him, get him, get him, get him. They're spreading all over the place. There we go. We got them. We got five of them right now. Nice. And when we leave the simula simulation, sli or simulation, <laughs> then he they, it should automatically convert them to bug reports or whatever. Oh, there you go. Picked up another one right there. Cool. Okay, so kind of just look at their faces. And if they... Oh, we have the ornaments of those guys. I guess we we knew about them a little... Oh, wait. Oh, something about that rock was kind of off. Something over here about these chickens kind of off. I guess I could just suck him up and, uh... Oh, oh, this guy. Oop, where'd he go? There he is. We got him right there. Nice. I don't know if I want to use too much of this debug spray, you know? I kind of want to save it. I don't know. Oh, these are the portals. Okay, those are the portals that you could use. Boom. Okay. So you, I guess you could either suction them up or hit them with a debug spray, and that, that, that makes them spread around like that. So might want to save that for the, uh, for the Largos like these guys. Yep. Boom. You can get like three, four, five of them or something like that from one Largo, which is really good. Here's another one. Yeah, look at that face. He's like all straight face like a ditto. Hold on, where'd he go? There he is. There he is. There he is. Yeah, I'm picking up regular pink slimes. Don't want to keep them in my inventory. I don't, I don't think it'd be kind of weird if you could take them from the slim slimulation. Well, that's another one. Yeah, yeah. So whenever they're like straight faced or if they're smiling with like a line for a mouth instead of like their mouth open, I guess they'd... Well, yeah, yeah that was a, I was about to say that one had a closed mouth, but it opened up for a second. Well, can I go into this cave over here that had to phosphor slimes and stuff? I wonder if it slimy... Oh! I guess it's slimy... Late. Oh, whoa, 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 that one's angry, though. Oh, well, these are... Yeah, these are always going to be angry because they're, uh... They're feral, right? So, I don't think I need to be surprised about that. Oh, oh, this one, this one, this one. Yep, yep, yep. There's like four or five of them right there that just came out of that Largo. We need to grab them. Boom, boom. We have 20 of them right now. Nice. So we can actually get that first thing right now. That's good. Now, how much time do we have left? I don't know. If I look at the gun, oh, it doesn't say there. Oh, we have a lot of debug spray. Ooh. I thought we had like less. Hold on. There's another one. Boom. Okay, so it looks like you get like three or something like that. I just saw like three of them come out right there. I thought you got way more from the uh, from the Largos. I guess not. Yep. We're up to 25. Cool. Keep chasing these guys around, though. So this is up to a portal. Is there anything else up here? No. Where are those treasure pods over here that I could actually... Uh, oh, oh. No, nah, there's nothing there. Yeah, I, I don't know if there would be treasure pods here. That'd be kind of weird, right? This area actually seems relatively small, to be quite honest. At least uh, I know where the portals are. There's one there, and there's a giant one out in the open. I don't know if there's anything over here, though. So can they... Oh, my... Whoa! Whoa! A lot of them just... I was about to say, can they can be uh, disguised as objects. Like that weird rock right there. I'm like, it didn't really look weird, but... Oh, that was an... Oh, my gosh. Random rocks. Random... I, I need to start using debug spray on rocks, you guys. Man, they keep escaping into the ocean, killing themselves. Oh, no! No, 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 no! Whoa, they just multiply right there? Oh, we're up to 43 already. That is crazy. I thought there was something right there now. Q-berries here. I wonder if they could be a Q-berry. I don't know. I don't know. Uh, oh, they can't... Whoa! What in the world? They could be like any... Whoa! Oh, no, they're the Tars. They're the Tars. Uh-oh, that's bad. That's bad. That's bad. That's bad. The portals better start opening. I'm near a portal right now, which is good. Hold on. Can I... Uh, let's go over here. Let's go over here. There might be rocks and stuff like that. Oh, the Tars are here. The Tars are here. Yep. Take them out of here. Take them out. No! The Tar portals have opened. The Tars are invading. Hold on, hold on. Any any other suspicious rocks or anything like that around here? Oh, here we go, here we go. Hit him with a debug spray. 
There we go. Oh, man, you look at that one. That one just exploded into like a thousand right there. Jeez, look at that. Another one. We're at the 60 right now, you guys. That's crazy. Oh, no. Error, error, error. Glitch slimes are bugs in the slim slimulation. Oh, pick him up, pick him up. Got him, got him. If we could find him. Oh, two more. Three more over here. Oh, my gosh. There are a lot of them. Oh, the, the tars are everywhere. Oh, follow the beacons. The beacons. Okay, he opened up the portals. That's good. The exit portals are open. Uh, that, oh, oh, this way. Oh, that one over there. That one over there. That was, uh, that we had a bunch of rocks. That one's open up. That's good. That's good. That's good. Go before we die. Ah, there you go. Are we in? Oh, okay. Oh, and they got converted over the bug reports. That's good. I didn't get any pink slimes, unfortunately. I thought I had like 60. Why do I have 57? I don't know. Either way, uh, oop, there you go. I don't know if I dropped any during that. That'd be kind of dumb if you could drop uh, glitch slimes during that, but oop, there you go. So we're getting some of the some of these cube things. Oh, what is it? Oh, I thought the whole world looked kind of different right there, but uh, look at that. We're up to uh, 57 out of 100 right there. We got more than half of what we needed right there, so that's amazing, you guys. I just don't know what that cube thing is right there, though. I need to go back and like watch my footage and see what he said during that cube bit. Uh, then, of course, I guess if we do his mission however many times we get access to this, and yeah, that thing right there is a slime toy vending machine thing. I think that's a decorizer right there. It might be, or... Yeah, it's gotta be like a decorizer right there. Uh, but I don't know if there are any like plots or anything like that that I can actually take use of here. Like, I'm not... Oh wait, yeah, there's one up there. there. Might be another one over there or something like that. I don't know, I can't really... Oh wait, yeah, there's another one, there's another one. I'm, I'm blind. <laughs> there's probably another one like right there. Okay, so there's a few plots. I don't know what's over there. And I don't know what these are over here. This is so weird. I don't know. Maybe he's going to tell us about it here in the future. I guess we can do it again. Oh, wait. Oh, there are the cubes. Manifold cube. It's a little bit of everything. Okay, so we actually got it right there. Dispensed out. I just didn't pick it up. So let's uh, open up the slime pedia. There you go. And let's see. Oh, there it is right there. Manifold cube. It already pulled it up. That's good. Slime science material. Not, fa not a slime food, so it's not favored by anyone. A manifold cube is an invention of slime scientist Victor Humphreys. He developed manifold cubes in order to save time, as manifold cubes contain traces of thousands of unique minerals and compounds, one of which can be activated by a fabricator to transform the whole manifold cube into the selected material. Ooh! Uh, Mochi has offered Victor a fortune in new bugs for the formula to creating manifold cubes, and he politely declined. Following this, Victor noted several attempts to hack his data server. When Victor asked Mochi to comment on the incident, she politely declined. <laughs> <laughs> Deposit manifold cubes in the uh, lab's refinery where it could then be used for crafting slime science gadgets. Interesting. So hold on. Let's go do that. Um, I don't know if I'm... I don't know if I interpret that. For, oh, oh yeah, yeah, then you... Uh, so we put the one there. So what happens now? Yep, manifold cube. Yep. So hold on. So if I wanted to make something... Yeah, I'm not seeing anything over here that would require it for the recipe. Oh man, oh yeah, those are... Uh, yeah, we already knew about the refinery link and stuff like that. Is there something over here I could do with the, uh, fashion pod remover? <laughs> Number one slime stay. Uh, we need to buy some of these things. Hydro turret, a defensive cannon that will automatically target tar and blast them with water. Yeah, some of you guys said I uh, maybe try and get some of these things and then have it blast the drone things. I don't know if that would work. I guess we could try it. I don't know how expensive it is, uh, like crafting wise, but we could definitely get the blueprint. Decently uh, cheap there. Med station drains your energy to restore health. I don't know if I need that right now. We get around the slime ball. As soon as a single slime passes through the hoop, what's your high score? <laughs> we should definitely get this sometime for the uh, for fun. Pink slime lamp. I thought we ha already had that. I guess we have something else. Oh, here's the Titan drill. Oh man, we could make the Titan drill with uh, pink plorts, rad plorts, and mosaic plorts. We could do it. Last 12 cycles. Whoa, has the highest chance for rare resources. We need to get the apiary version of that, you guys. Holy heck. Let's fabricate. Three of those? Should we do it? Let's do it. Let's go put it in the indi er, yeah, indigo quarry. How many did I make? Oh, I have two of them. Yeah, let's get three of them. Sure. Boom. Advanced drill. Uh, oh, yeah. Then the next thing, we need like 150,000. That would be the uh, advanced, or the, uh, what would it be? Titan pump, I guess it'd be. I don't know what the tier three is. Like, we have a tier one novice drill, tier two advanced drill, and then a tier four titan drill. I don't know what number three is. Like, we're missing it. Like, it goes from this, this. And then blah, and it turns into a big old boy right there. It's crazy. I don't know where to get the tier three uh, from, but uh, who knows? We might have skipped over it right there and gone all the way to the best, which is great. And I could probably end up that, of course. And I don't know what that's all about. I might need to do more research on that some other time. Or let me know in the comments down below if you guys know how that works. Oh, whoops. Didn't mean to... Man, I just skipped through all this again. Yeah, I, I wanted to go back into the simulation right there and I accidentally... 
hold this up. <laughs> He's doing his pre-recorded thing. There you go, okay. <laughs> Let's go back into the simulation. Or slimulation. Gotta make sure I say it correctly like that, right? <laughs> and now we know a little bit more. Oh, wait. Oh! Man. Oh, there's a secret skin! Oh, is that for the glitch? Oh, that's probably for the glitch slime, right? Retro. Ooh, it's got like little... Oh, there we go. We got some debug sprays. We got 15 right there. That's good. So hold on. Let me, uh... Oh, a couple of them right there. Nice, nice. We got one. Wait. Oh, we didn't get one right there. It ran away. There we go. Gl glitch slime. So at least it sticks out a little bit more. Oh, wait. Yep, that is a... Uh, that is definitely a fake one. There you go. Boom. Oh, man. There's a... Uh... Hold on. What about that one? Oh, I knew it. I knew it. I just had a feeling that one was fake. Oh, I picked up a real one right there. Whoops. Boom slime. Boom. Boom. Oh, what in the world? Oh, it's a pink uh, honey one right there. Interesting. Oh, those are uh, mint mangoes there. I don't know if any of these guys need to be debug sprayed. What about this one? Nah, that was real. That's real. Man, I don't know where that other one was. I'm pretty sure there was another one around here. It ran away. Ah, man, I missed it. I don't know where it is. Let's keep going around, though. This doesn't really feel familiar of the uh, the moss blanket. Oh, wait, yeah, now it does. Yeah, see, this is the entrance is where we have our pumps and stuff like that, you know? Yep. Oh, that was, that was a fake one. This is the fake. Get him, get him, get him, got him. Nice. There's another one around here somewhere. I don't know where, though. Yeah, it's gone. I'm gonna go up here. This is where our teleporter was. A gray teleporter. Oh, there's a treasure. Oh, there are treasure pods here. Yeah, there's a secret skin and there's treasure pods. This is crazy. Battery tower, a massive battery powered apparatus that seems to power something somewhere. I don't know what that would be used for, but maybe decoration. Who knows? Is that a real? Oh, yeah, yeah, that's real. Okay. I don't know if any. Oh, oh there was a puddle one right there. I don't know if any glitch slimes can go into water like that, you know? Can, is this a real? Oh, man, uh, it is a real area, but uh, I'm almost out of stamina, so I need to watch out. Yep. Give, give me some more of that uh, debug spray there. I guess it just takes you to a further part of the. Moss blanket. I'm like, you didn't really finish this part of the simulation. Slimulation. But, uh, yep. guess we'll, uh, yep. make our way all the way back here and hopefully we can find some hunter uh, glitch slimes or whatever. <laughs> Let's see. Oh, there's that's a portal right there, too. Cool. Let's see if we can find any, uh, oh, whoop. oh, those were both fit. Oh, 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 they do survive in water. That's good, I think. Oh, but they kind of blend in with water with their new skin now, though. Man, oh, it's flying all over. 14. Uh oh, 5th to 16. Nice. All right, well, let's keep chasing these guys around. Hold on, hold on. Let's do a big boom, boom. Oh, that didn't work, man. These guys, yep, they're, they're real. Yeah, man. Oh, we'd actually find a few of them right there when they popped out of the ground. They're all kind of, oh, oh, hunter ones. Oh, fake, fake. Got them. Got the glitches. Nice. Uh, oh, a couple of them were right there were fake. I think it, no, no, man, one of them went into water. Yeah, seems like they go into water as their like escape plan. So might might want to watch out for that. Skip more of the uh, debug spray here. There we go, maxed out thirty, perfect. Oh man, oh no, 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 no. get out of here, no, we're gonna lose these guys. There's one. Nah, that's real. Nah, that was real too. Oh, there you go, got him, got a fake one. Nice, awesome. I don't know, is that real? Nah, it was real. Okay. That's real too. Yeah, I know. You know what? I I got comments from you guys saying there's a uh, a honey, Gordo. Oh, oh, nice, nice, nice. Gordo somewhere in the moss blanket. I need I need to look around a little bit more uh, carefully there. I'm, I'm actually surprised that we found the uh, hunter lart or hunter Gordo before we found the the honey Gordo. Which I'm like he's cam oh speaking of camouflage, boom. The hunter one's camouflage. And we still found him before the honey one, which is crazy. That's so the 34 right now. We just need to get what 40. Seven, I think? I forget how many we had. Either 47 or 43 or something like that, right? Oh, fake! Got him! Nice! If we could find some more Largos, that'd be amazing. Or, yeah, when you look at, like, rocks and stuff like that, too, they, they could be fake, too. Oh, oh, real. I'm like, I have so much debug spray. Oh, oh, oh! Lot of them right here. I have so much debug spray. Might as well just use it. Uh, because that's what it's used for, right? You don't, you don't want to just hoard it around and just not being used at all. I wonder if a chicken can be, uh... Nah, I guess not. What about a chicken do or whatever? Oh, the the holes are starting to open with the tars coming into this world. That's bad. That's bad. Oh, a couple fake right here. Nice, awesome. Sort the forty three. I think that's how many we need, but I'm I kind of want to get a few more just to be safe, you know. Oh, fake right there. Awesome. Get like yeah. See it. It, it doesn't seem like it's a, a, a strict number. How many you get from these guys? Oh, oh no, another fake right there. Nice. Oh, that's a real uh. What do you call it, right? Oh, man, Tars. I don't, know, dude, I don't know what the Tars do with the glitches. 
I need to be- Oh, jeez, I'm exploding now with the boom slime stuff of that over here. Oh, nice! Got another fee right here. Cool! Yeah, we're definitely over a hundred now, you guys. We had 50-something earlier. We have 50 right now. That's good. Should have the, uh, the first- Oh! The deep- Oh, exit portal activated. Where? This way. Okay, good. We just look at the little little alerts here at the top of the screen and- Oh, man, whoa! Something happened to make the- Oh, I guess a tar maybe interacted with a, uh, a, a glitch and they exploded there, so that's crazy. We still have a lot of health, though, so we can soak up uh, a lot of damage, which is awesome. Yep, keep going this way. All right. Man, I guess there's just one singular portal that's open during this thing. You have to try and find the exit portal that's activated. And it might be across the map like it is right now for us. <gasps> oh, look! Oh, I've got a hand in! Why'd he not eat? Oh, it's a faker! It's a fake! It's a heckin' fake! I knew it! I knew it! He fooled me in the middle of the simulation! I need to leave, too! No, he went into water! Ah, where is it? Uh, okay, still this way. That's good, that's good. But at the same time, it's still so far away, I just need to leave! Oh, he's exploding! Keep going. This way. Where in the world is the exit? What is this? I don't remember this! What is this? Oh wait, I, I okay, I remember with- Oh, this is where the reality is where the- Oh, jeez! This is where the rad slimes are and stuff like that, you guys. We need to be very careful. We don't have any stamina. We have a little bit of debug spray, but I don't think we need to use that right now. Oh, wait, we're losing uh, glitch slimes. What happens to the... Oh, no. This is bad. This is bad. This is bad. You you lose glitch slimes. I must have read something about it and completely forgot about it already. Yep, Faker, right? I knew it. Yep, got him. Oh, we don't have any more debug spray. Golly. Where in the world's the exit at? I don't know. Uh, this way... Oh my god, a gold! But it's a fake, too! <gasps> gimme, gimme, gimme! Oh my god, that gold had like 10 glitches inside of him? Holy heck, that's crazy. Boom! Oh no! Where in the- Get over here! Yep. And there's like two more right here. Got him, nice. Oh, there's a- f I just got a fake right there accidentally, crazy! We're up to 53, awesome. Where are we going? Oh gosh, there it is right there. Get the- Oh no, no, get back, get back! <laughs> there are glitches, I need to get him! Oh my gosh, I don't know. Okay, forget it, forget it. We're at 55. Woo! Let's leave the slimulation with 55 bug reports. There we go. Yep, we're back in the real world now. Okay. We had, uh, we had 57 last time. We have 55 now. Man, yeah, I don't know what happens when you lose them, though. I don't know what uh, causes that. Probably getting damaged by like a guitar or something like that. So, either way, let's go over here. Yep, there. Oh, whoa! Whoops, that's uh, extra right there. So we got some sort of technology right there. Definitely want to answer his call. Got extra bug reports. Grab the manifold cubes right there. Boom. Let's see what he has to say. Hello again, Beatrix. I am currently in the middle of important work and require focus time for the next several minutes. Therefore, I have contracted out the phase one reward distribution to a scientific colleague of mine. Connecting you now. Oh, who's this? Oh, is that Bob? That looks like Bob. Look at that hat. <laughs> is Bob... <laughs> that is totally Bob! Or like, a Bob. Maybe there's like multiple Bobs or something like that. Hello? Chicken? <laughs> chicken? Chicken equals chicken plus chicken. <laughs> He's even got the Game Boy right there. Look at the slides peeking their eye out over there. Uh, now then, I trust that my colleague compensated you well. Uh, not really, he didn't really do anything except for say chicken a couple times. Like three, four times. <laughs> Hmm, no, I never actually met him in person, but that's not unusual for me. You see, I generally run simulations for everything I can in my life, including relationships with others. Oh, jeez. <laughs> Wonder how that goes. <laughs> you might think this is, uh, perhaps too clinical of an approach, but I can assure you it saves a significant amount of time. And time is so valuable, and so very finite, it is the singular cruelty of nature. So why waste a second of it building a friendship that ends, jeez, or a romantic interest that leaves you cold, wasteful? Man, I don't know, I, I, I could kind of see why he's doing it now, but at the same time, it's kind of weird. <laughs> so I simulate it all and determine where it is likely to lead. It is all very precise and allows me to operate on a timeline that is most optimal. That's probably how he actually came in contact with us, knowing that we'll get his missions done in an optimal manner. Watch, he's probably going to say that like right now. But clearly there are still kinks to work out, as a simulation I ran of you assisting me had you completing phase one much later than the actual result. How odd. Ooh, see, look at that. I did a lot better than his simulation said. <laughs> I'll add fixing this issue to my agenda. In the meantime, let's begin phase two of our project. 
The bug reports you've submitted so far are fascinating. Within the limits of slimulation, glitch slimes appear to be very much real. I need to know more. Gather more bug reports and I'll grant you access to the blueprints for my custom advanced drones. Ooh, that's what we need! Those are the drones that... You could have like more than two, I think, or something like that, per area. Maybe you could you command him to do multiple things instead of like uh, just, oh, you collect plorts and then you get another drone, be like, oh, you you sell plorts. I guess maybe we could have a, one drone do both. Maybe that'd be good. Uh, they're doubly effective at ranch work efficiency. Boom, but I didn't even read that line right there and I basically guessed it. Well, I, I'm pretty sure I mentioned it in previous episodes as well. <laughs> uh, dot, 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 dot. Sorry, I often forget about goodbyes. Um, uh, goodbye uh, for now. <laughs> Jeez. <laughs> Alright, well, we do have some bug reports we could uh, submit right there, but we have to give them 360 until we give us the advanced drones. Oh, man. Well, at least we have some more of the uh, manifold cubes. I don't know what to do with them, but uh, other than, of course, put them inside the refinery, but I just don't know what to do with them past that point, you know? So, uh, oh, yeah, then some sort of blueprint that we got right there, right? What is it? What, what, do, we, what do we get? We get anything over here? Oh, it's probably already unlocked, right? Yeah, you don't have to actually buy it. But I want to at least uh, see chicken cloner. That's what it was. <laughs> Doubles your chickens half the time. Uh, hold on. Wait a minute. How does that work? How do I make that chicken cloner? We have five out of the six that we need to get the chicken cloner. <laughs> we need one strange diamond. I don't even remember where we. St I'm pretty sure we had like two or three actually that are gone now, so we must have spent them on something. And then uh, we need a few more tabby plores, 16 more, and then we've got that. So eh, maybe next episode we can make the chicken cloner because we already have like, what, 12 or something like that of the uh, bug reports uh, like submitted to them. So we just need to give them like eight more and then boom, we're good to go. These guys are actually hungry. Ooh, well, hopefully we have food we can give them. Oh, man, I don't have any water. What happened to my water? Uh, I guess the going through the slimulation thing completely emptied out your inventory there. So that kind of sucks, man. I need to go fill it up somewhere. I don't know where, though. Hopefully my uh, drones over here are doing... Uh, they have a little bit of water right there. I, they're out working, but I definitely need to replenish my water and, you know, get these guys their water replenished as well. But either way, I, I guess we could... Oh, man, look at the chickens. See, I guess if we had the chicken cloner, we'd have 10 chickens right now instead of just one or hen hens or whatever. And you know what? That makes sense that Bob... The, or I assume that guy's name is Bob. <laughs> gave us the chicken cloner, or I assume... I don't, yeah, I don't think he actually did. He just said chicken like three times, and then I guess Victor had to give it to us, right? I don't know. I don't know what actually happened there. I'm still very confused about the whole situation. <laughs> but either way, uh, cube berries. Boom. Let's get some more of the uh, ash inside there so we continue. There you go. Producing more fire plorts. There you go. See, these are fire floors. Boom floors. We had them confused last episode. But yeah, this episode, I had a lot of fun checking out Victor Humphrey's area there, doing the glitch slime mission there. That's really cool. I like it. Even though all the uh, the missions, like with Mochi Miles, and, and Victor and uh, Ogden Ortiz were they're all very similar they're still pretty unique all on their own to be quite honest which is really really cool makes it really really fun too still need to go speaking of such I still need to go back to Mochi Miles do her mission like pff, I don't know how many times I'd have to, I have to I forgot how many we already submitted to her and how many how many we need you know so probably need to do that like four or five more times like four or five more races or something like that until we could actually fully unlock her area over there, you know? And then, of course, same thing with Ogden. Probably need to go through his area like four or five times until we can actually uh, give him enough, uh, what are they called? Oh, I forgot what those weird berries were called. <laughs> ah. Kukadobas? I think, the, yeah, Kukadobas. Just thought right there, I was thinking like, what is a, what is a really stupid name? Yeah, Kukadoba, that's it, right? <laughs> Uh, but yeah, it, oh, I wonder how the food's doing over here. This is usually pretty low. Oh, they, oh, only one hen hen right there. So I'm glad I got this up. Boom. Oh, these guys are, oh, I probably should have gave them some uh, hen hens right there instead of putting it inside the thing. But, uh, oh, we have a lot of babies over here. That's good. Uh, briar hens. There you go. Grab the extras. There we go. So we have six. Oh, and then uh, there's got to be old ones here too. So one, two. Do we don't have any roostros? Oh, I need to go get some roostros. Oh, I, yep. I bet they uh, got old. Man. That sucks. These are, uh, Elder Ro Yep, Elder Rustro, I knew it. Man, that sucks so much. Either way, uh, these guys are... Their favorite thing is Rustro, right? So, uh... Wait, no! Uh, it was Briarhand for these guys. Who wanted the Rustros? I forgot who wanted the Rustros. Uh, someone that wanted meat. I don't know who that would be then. Yeah, I don't know. Because the Painted Hen one was the, uh, the Dervish one. Or no, uh, the Tangle one, right? 
I don't know who wanted the rooster. Oh, I guess, yeah, I, I guess it was the hunter one. It's just that the elder one, I guess they don't like the elder one. They'd rather have the, the younger one, I guess you could say. <laughs> so, either way, definitely want to end the episode off about right now, though, because we've got a lot of progress done this episode, you guys, and I had a lot of fun. I hope you guys did, too. Be, if you guys did, be sure to let me know. Oh, whoops. If you guys did, be sure to let me know by leaving a like down below. And if you guys want more of these awesome videos, be sure to hit that subscribe button. And of course, while you're down there, be sure to ring that bell so YouTube lit all these. This is what's crazy. I get extra pogo fruit and stuff like that from over there. <laughs> and then feed it to these guys and then just go into a frenzy eating a bunch of pogo fruit and giving me a bunch of pinks, uh, pink porch, which is why we have so many of them over there in storage. <laughs> but yeah, be sure to hit that like button, hit the subscribe button, ring the bell. And then uh, every time I upload a new episode of Slime Rancher, YouTube will let you know as soon as that episode comes out because next time we come back with slime rancher i definitely want to do more uh, I, I i definitely want to do at least another on camera victor humphreys mission uh try and get more of the bug report things because we, we just need one more uh manifold thing in order to make the chicken where in the world was it chicken cloner <laughs> then uh, oh yeah then we still need the strange diamond so we can't even make it next episode unless i'm like really lucky let, let me look at the strange diamond real quick hold on how what what gets that? I, I know it's rare and whatnot, but like what is it going to tell me? Like, is it come out of? Oh, yeah, obtained with the drill. Oh, you guys, we didn't even place down the uh, the drills this episode yet. We made them the Titan drills. We have the highest likelihood of getting the rare thing, which is the strange diamond. You guys next episode, we might get at least one strange diamond over here. Uh, yes, this way, because we have three of the best drills and then we just need one strange diamond and then I just need some tabby up. Uh, no, wait, what is it? What in the world? What did I hit right there that made that pop up? <laughs> uh, I don't even know why. That completely derailed my train of thought right there. Uh, but you guys probably know what I mean here. Oh, yeah. Place these down. But yeah, we just need one strange diamond. I mean, these three right here already have the best likelihood of, of getting them. Uh, so next episode, we should have a strange diamond. And then, of course, need like 16 tabby floors. Just go over there and make sure we get the tabby floors before a uh, drone sells it or whatever. Actually, no, we don't have a market link over there. So we just go grab them anyways and then bring them over here. And then, of course, doing that one more uh, uh, Victor Humphreys mission over here. That's going to definitely give us enough of the uh, the bug reports to get one more of those manifold things. So we'll definitely be able to make the chicken cloner next episode. Hopefully, not definitely, hopefully be able to make it. <laughs> Because uh, there is still that likelihood that we won't get a strange diamond out of those three uh, Titan drill things over there, which really suck. But either way, I already did the outro right there. So thank you guys all very much for watching. And I'll see you guys here next time with some more Slime Rancher. Oh, bye there.